All right, guys. Today we're tuning this uh, 416 cubic inch uh, LS deal, obviously in a 98 Corvette. Um, car's super nice for what it is. Check it out. All right, here's this vet. You're gonna have to excuse the door dinger and my phone ringing in the background. Um, but man, this thing's super nice. 98 uh, automatic car. It's got a 416 inch LS deal in it. BTR intake manifold. Uh, it's a stock um, LS3 style cylinder head. Excuse me. Uh, I think it's got a BTR cam in it. I don't remember which cam's in it. It's got like a 3500 converter, which actually the converter's flashed to like 54 in high gear. Um, so. Yeah, this has been uh, at another shop on their dyno. I'm just gonna touch a couple things up and see how it goes, see what we can make with it. Um, yeah, with the factory cylinder head, this setup, I'm still pump gas. I'm guessing we uh, we end up somewhere in the mid 400s. So we'll give it a shot here. Let's see what you Just finished up with this thing, made 450 horsepower, 367 foot pounds of torque. Power curve looks good. It's uh, unfortunately, we had to stop a bit early because we are out of fuel system up top. Uh, it's pretty lean up there, and uh, fuel pressure is all the way down to like 30 pounds by the time I got the 7,000. So we bailed. We're gonna fix the thing up, or he's gonna, the customer's gonna fix this up and uh, bring it back when we get that sorted. So, yeah, I think. Uh, I think we can turn this to probably, I don't know, 72, 7,300 make peak power up there once we get some fuel in it. Um, if we get it to turn that hard and it's still power still climbing like it is now, I think it'll make uh, mid 460 to the tire. Not bad on pump gas. I know being a 416, a lot of people would expect a little bit more out of it, but it is still a stock cylinder head deal. Um, I think if this had an aftermarket set of heads on it, we'd see a, a large uh, a large difference there. I don't know who did the heads. I don't know if they're stock as cast or if they're ported. I don't know anything about them. But uh, yeah, that's it for now. We'll get this fuel system fixed, bring it back, and see what we can make with it. So stay tuned.